Hello everyone! <laughs> My name is Hex, this is Hex Mania, and welcome back to Danganronpa 2. Um, last time Fuyuhiku just cut himself open. Um, uh, I don't know how to feel about that. Um, but uh, now we got free time, so... We... <laughs> uh, also, he specifically cut himself open as an apology. So, right now, we are going to go hang out with Chiaki, because it's time. Let's, let's go hang out with her again. So, where is she? That's where Nagito is. Okay, Chiaki's in her room. So, let's just... There she is. There's Chiaki. Let me just... Oh, jeez. There's some... <laughs> there goes my water bottle. Okay. I'm just trying to figure out where to best put this mic. Because I want y'all to be able to hear me. Alright, ding dong. Who is it? It's me! Hello! Oh. Oh, she has an entire arcade machine! Oh my goodness. And her blankets! Oh my goodness. Uh. Alright. I'm sorry to get hungry. Maybe we sh I should head to the diner. Yes, let's hang out. Yep. Yeah, you can come with me. I spent time today eating a hamburger at the diner with Chiaki. Hamburger? <laughs> Looks like Chiaki and I grew a little closer. Yes! Present! She like the rose. I still have one more of the rose. So. Um. Isn't that a pretty rare item? Yeah, it's the same dialogue. Okay. <sighs> Every single time. I can't believe how she quickly she falls asleep in such a short time. Samurai head. Statue of Liberty. Ah, uh, don't shoot the beam there. This is bad. Zombie Nation eating up humans. Is she dreaming about a game? I have no idea what kind of game she's talking about. Sorry. Ah, uh, sorry. I think it was sleeping again. Are you playing a video game in your dream too? Yeah. It was fun because it was a shooting game. I see, so you like those kinds of games. Yep. I'm pretty all inclusive. I'll play anything from Space Invaders to the latest military shooters. Ah, uh, I also like simulation games. Right now, I mainly play real time strategy games, but I like term based ones too. Hey, hey. So, where do you want to go today? Yeah, um, how, do we go to, uh, how about we go to the ranch today? I don't really like animals that much. Huh? Really? They're warm when you touch them, you know? That's a little scary. It's kind of hard to guess what they'll do next. Well? I'm better at games that use precise calculations where success and failure is decided by numerical values. But it's hard for me to play games where I have to manage relationships and guess what characters are feeling. I see. Maybe that has something to do with her upbringing. I don't want to do things Jackie will hate, but it feels lonely to just leave her like this. How about we go look at the animals from far away? The ones at the ranch are pretty tame. You can even try to touch them if it looks safe. Okay. I think. If you teach me lots of things, it'll probably be okay. I think. Is she relying on me? If so, that makes me happy. Yay! Chiaki! Chiaki and I decided to walk to the ranch. Oh my! It's a cow! I wonder if it's gonna dance like the one in Dancing Eyes. <laughs> that might be a little difficult. Maybe I should try touching it a little. Chiaki walked up to the cow and pat cautiously pet its back. The cow seemed to not mind and continued silently eating grass. Wow, it's really warm! Well, that's because it's alive. I see, you're right. Unlike humans, animals don't mind being touched that much. So, that might make it easier for me. If you touch a person, something is born from that interaction, right? Repulsion, anticipation, whatever. I'm nervous about stuff like that. It makes me think I'm better off not doing anything on the... Unnecessary. I think Shiaki might be on the t <laughs> might have the tism. <laughs> just a little bit. Like, it's better if I can just stay an innocent bystander for as long as I can. Shiaki's feelings seem a little odd, but I do understand where she's coming from. 
I hope that one day she could touch uh, touch not just cows, but people too. Uh, you know, if we make a milk this cow, I'm sure the fresh milk must be really tasty. Hey, hey. Milk this cow? Huh? Um, you know that milk comes from cows, right? What do you mean from? Milk is milk, right? You know, if you pull out a cow's udders, milk comes. <laughs> oh, Jimmy, please. Um, you only need one cow to get as much milk as you want. As much as you want. But if you try to cool it up in a milk bottle, a cow comes out of it, right? And it dances, right? I knew it! It's definitely dancing, guys! Seriously, what kind of game is she talking about? I explained how milk works to Chiaki in detail. Or are there so many things she doesn't know? As usual, Chiaki is full of mysteries. Yay! Chiaki started to feel sleepy from playing too much, so after sending her off, I returned to my room. Do we get another free time? Yeah, still bright out, still plenty of time today. No way I can just stay here and do nothing. I should cry soon somewhere. Alright. So first of all... Let's check Sakami, alright. And then I kind of want to just check her report card real quick. Because I'm curious. Oh good, we only need one more interaction from her. Cool. So, 5-2. Okay. Likes games, even crappy games. Just like the alarm clocks. <laughs> she hates like like a video game, which is why she won't allow any killings. She told me games are supposed to be fun and that focusing on winning and like losing is pointless. She doesn't know about Girls' Day. Everyone knows about that. I wonder why she made, she sat me and made her. Uh, I taught I teach her lots of new things and made me to promise to see her again. <clears throat> She's not used to living creatures and it's hard for her to play games about managing relationships and guessing what characters are feeling. That sounds really lonely. All right. We're gonna find her once more. Where is she? So... Okay, she's just in the lobby again. She really, like... Girly. <laughs> girly pop. You... Oh god, I felt so cringe saying that. Uh, but... Does she just not want to go anywhere else? Just... If so, she's valid. <laughs> okay, Snake and me's fine. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I keep checking on Snake and me. I promise the next time I'm just gonna let Snake and me run and get all those spare points to see what happens. Okay, it's Chiaki! Hello! Huh? What happened? Are you bored or something? Yes, I wanna hang out. Well? I'm bored too. Let's think of a way to kill time together. Mm. Huh? Oh, we can uh, kill time together with that, I think. I killed time with Chiaki as we thought about different ways to kill time. <laughs> Looks like Chiaki and I grew a little closer. Yes! So, we don't have any more rose in vitros, but she also likes the skulls. Yeah, skull head mask. Here it is. Yeah, okay, totally surprised. Thanks. Hey, hey. Hey, hey, where do you want to go today? This is the first time I've seen Chiaki look so interested. And she's not even sleeping. Maybe she was looking forward to this. Let's see, why don't we check out the storage room in the old building? We might something uh, find something interesting. Like, Sokoban. That's a fun game to play. It's this old puzzle game where you have to push boxes in a warehouse to get to, uh, to their assigned spots. Oh, I see. Let's go. Then, let's run over to Monami so we can go inside the storage room. Jackie pumped herself up, and after winning over Monami, she went in, uh, we went into the storage room. Hmm, there's not a whole lot you can push and pull. Don't tell me you were serious about playing Sokoban in the storage room! No wonder she, see, uh, she, she, uh, she seems so excited about coming here. Hey, hey. hey, Hajime, are you good at puzzle games? Nah, I'm not that good at using my brain. Dude! <laughs> Trials? Buddy? Unless it's Izuru that's been taking over this whole time, you dumb idiot. Huh? Really? Maybe you don't I just don't like them because you haven't played that many. Well, you know how to properly theorize in order to view things, and you can call me manage uh, call me managed when it's important. I feel like you'd be good at puzzle games once you got the hang of it. Huh? You really see me like that? Th that kind of embarrasses me. For example, Rubik's cubes and jigsaw puzzles are puzzle games too. Oh yeah, I remember putting together a lot of jigsaw puzzles when I was little. 
Yep, yep, then you already know the trick, right? The trick to jigsaw puzzles. Well, it's, it's outer pieces in, but I'll double check to make sure it's correct. Yeah, it's outer pieces in. Um, you assemble from the outer pieces, right? Yep. That's right. First you separate the pieces with edges. Afterwards, you separate the leftovers by color. It makes putting together a lot and putting it together a lot easier. I see. Now I feel kind of uh, like pulling it. Ah. Now I kind of feel like putting one together since it's been such a long time. Ah, that reminds me. My father always pro programmed puzzle games. Your father is a programmer. Yep. yep. Apparently, he was pretty manly when he was focusing in front of his laptop. Mm. But I hear he couldn't solve a puzzle he made, and it really impressed him. But since he hated losing, he actually went out of his way to write a separate program. And then he made the program to stuff like fruit, <laughs> like a fruit for his attack. Fruit what? Uh, um, it's way of forcibly finding out the answer. No worries, though, it's a normal fruit to not know. I don't really understand, but it seems like Chiaki also knows about programming. But more importantly, why does everything she say about her father seem so he uh, sound like hearsay? Wouldn't that mean she per didn't personally see it? Ah, hey, hey. uh, we should get going and head back. Yeah, you're right. Huh? Ah! Huh? I quickly opened my arms and caught Chiaki as she fell into them. Are you okay? Ah, oh, how embarrassing. I've never tripped before in my life. As she, si uh, as she said that, she stepped away from my chest. My heart sounds really loud. Oh no! <laughs> no! No, not the romance round! <laughs> of course it does this my heart. Ah, uh, that surprised me. You're pretty hard, Hajime. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'm... <laughs> Unlike me, your arms and chest are really built. You're definitely a boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Chiaki, please. Oh, that's what you meant. Yeah, that's obvious. No, you totally weren't talking. <laughs> oh my god. And I'm glad you caught me. That means I'll be fine in case of emergencies. Even if I sound like it's sleepy, I'll be fine. You can carry me. Hey, don't sleep. Hmm? Yay! <laughs> Friendship. I desperately tried to keep Chiaki from falling asleep and walked her back to her room. Yay, friendship. How much time we got? Oh, plenty of time. It's getting dark outside. It's nighttime already. Huh, that fell fast. Ever since I arrived at this island, a, a day passes by abnormally fast. You know, it's... <laughs> the doorbell. Does that mean someone's here? I cautiously walked towards the door and opened it, slowly worry, slowly worry about what it might have been on the other side. God damn it, Ibuki! <laughs> it's the past heads of nice to meet you. You know, since we've already exchanged nice to meet yous, Ibuki, you again. <laughs> Allow me to apologize for surprising you with my sudden visit. I'm sorry. Well, it's a lot better than last time when you broke into my room. Huh? <laughs> You must be the type who holds scratches. My ears and joints hurt. That means you have gout. <laughs> so what do you want? Um, Ibuki doesn't get either, but it looks like an invitation was sent to everyone. Invitation? Yes. See, this thing. What the? That's totally a girl's writing. Invitation ticket. 9pm at Titty Typhoon. <laughs> I still can't get over that. <laughs> Party for Fuyuhiko. Here's the Rio's recovery. Yeah, um, uh, what is this? Is this Monokuma doing again? Why, you? How rude! Don't put that in the same category as Monokuma. Is this your doing? I don't know what you're talking about at all. Ibuki just, just brought the invitation. It's definitely her. <laughs> well then, Ibuki has some preparations, so I'll go ahead. I'll leave it to you. She even said preparations. She's completely behind this. Use of any uncert island. 9pm, that's in 30 minutes. But even though it's a party for Fuyuhiko's recovery, is he even going to be able to come? I'd probably just slid his stomach in the morning. Oh my god. But she took the trouble to do this out of goodwill. I guess I should head over to the music venue. Alright. Getting out of here. Alright. So I guess we're just walking there. Check on Snake and me. Like I, I gotta check on Snake and me every time I walk. Like every so often, I just. 
Like I don't want to accidentally miss poop again. I, I want I want snake me to be happy. I want I want a happy snake, you know. Alright. Third island. By the way, I do appreciate that there's a fast travel feature, but they also, you know, they made an incentive for me to walk, okay? Because, like, oh yeah, there's this creature that you can have if you actually walk and you get coins for it, so, you know. I can't help it. Miss the movie theater. Oh, okay. Wizard of Monami. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, Monami's cute. Um, Wild Gunman Monokuma. That's Electric Avenue. Check on the snake. Snake's fine. There's a motel. There we go. And the Titty Typhoon. I still can't believe it's named that. Like, oh my goodness. Like, it's so silly and ridiculous. Oh. Hello. Nagito, Yibuki invited you too, right? Yep. Yeah, I'm honored, but since everyone else is also going to be there celebrating Fuyuhiko's recovery, no matter what, I think it's rude for, uh, too rude for someone like me to go inside before everyone else arrives. Uh, you don't have to worry about me, you can go inside first. Believe me, I'm not worried. <laughs> this too must be the of Tonight's constellation heralds the banquet that celebrates Fuyuhiko's resurrection. <laughs> How idealistic. Now then, let us begin the ceremony of darkness. This guy, oh, who cares about anymore? <laughs> oh. Several people had already arrived in the music venue, but. Vihiko, why are you. What? Is it bad I came? No, not that. Is it okay for you to move around? It's gonna be fine. Yeah, it's nothing. There's no way you're okay! You're seriously injured! Even so. They took the time to throw a party for me. There's no way I wouldn't come. I understand how you feel, but you really shouldn't overwork yourself. I am not overdoing it. Fine then, just let him do whatever he wants. But... It's fine, just let him be. Apparently Yakuza have pain tolerance down to an art. I can't believe he's actually forcing himself to join this kind of event. The old Fuyuhiko probably wouldn't have come no matter how much we invited him. He's probably trying his very best to change. Hey. But it looks like Kyoko definitely didn't come. That seems to be the case. Huh? And Akane's not here too. What is that wild woman off doing? I hope she's not planning to do anything strange. As if right on cue, uh, as if on cue, right when Mana. Uh, Nekomaru expressed his unease. That's when it happened. My. Oh my! Suddenly the stage lit up very brightly and the person who appeared was... Just as I thought, that's what she was going for. Well, she is the ultimate musician, after all. I can't imagine what else she'd do in a music venue. Right. I'll start singing this first song with full-on energy! So, put your hands together for... From me, to you, too! Yeah, Since she was originally a member of a high school girls band that dominated the music charts, I could probably look forward to her musical stylings. Yeah. Oh! We get to just watch this! Oh 
fuck? Okay, she's singing in Japanese. <laughs> I'm going to probably just skip this. Can I- Are you all surprised by her? Uh, we'll continue this next time, though. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see ya.